Hi, my name is Mr. Gertson. I'm the secondary school principal at Abbotsford Christian School. ACS is an amazing school with rich programs, a passionate staff, and a great facility. Our mission is to engage minds, nurture hearts, and shape God's world. We serve Christian families by creating a safe learning environment where our students can explore, experience, and evaluate all of life under God. We also seek to discover and develop our students' unique gifts and abilities through personalized learning and innovative teaching strategies. We work hard to lead students toward faithful, discerning, obedient, and creative lives of service. The core of who we are is found in our Christian worldview. We're striving to lead students toward being authentic followers of Jesus. We want our students to see their faith as holistic, where all parts of their lives are influenced by their faith in Christ. We want students to understand how a dualistic faith, religion just tacked on to sort of a real life, it's not a biblical idea. Following Jesus means being committed to living His way in all ways. And that is a different way. In the next few minutes, we want to share with you some of the opportunities we provide our students at ACS. We've moved toward project-based learning and sophisticated student presentations of learning in our pedagogy. Our goal is to engage students in authentic learning, which allows innovative ways to fulfill our mission. Hello, my name is Casey Kowalczyk, and I'm a student here at ACS. When I think about my time here at ACS, one word comes to mind, creativity. When I walk down the hall, I see opportunities where my friends' gifts and abilities are used through projects and works of art. For example, when you walk into the shop, you see students there who have the gift of mechanics and engineering. They're in there working on real cars for actual people. In fact, many families who can't afford getting their cars fixed have taken their vehicles to our shop. That makes this an incredible program. Students also show creativity in the wood shop through practical projects that end up in students' living rooms. When you go into the multi-purpose room, you see people there who are building a stage for the drama productions made play. And every year, the set looks incredible. We've done some significant stage productions at ACS, including Les Mis and The Diary of Anne Frank. When you open the doors to the music room, there's always people making beautiful music in either band class, a praise team, or maybe just jamming out on instruments during lunch hour. We even have a group of students who have recorded a CD, and they're still in high school. And I haven't even mentioned our textiles program, the foods program, or the library yet, so make sure you check those out yourself. Hello, my name is Jake Stelpstra. I teach art at Abbotsford Christian Secondary. Each day, our students arrive with all their unique gifts and abilities, but they also arrive with some of their hurts and experiences, which they bring to our community, and particularly to our classrooms. I like to think of our art room as a place where students can share some of this and grow from it. They can express themselves through their artwork, and the joy that they find in this expression often contrasts directly with some of the pain that they find themselves living with in other parts of their lives. Our goal is to enable students to become faithful, discerning, and creative servants of God and neighbor. Hello, my name is uh, Ed Van Worden, and I'm a math teacher here at ACS. I teach everything from rational numbers to symmetry and surface area to scale factors, geometry, and even some trigonometry. Whatever it is, it's a whole lot of fun. And of course, I have some problems. I'm a math teacher. Bonjour, je m'appelle Madame Horhan, and I'm the French teacher here at Abbotsford Christian Secondary School. We strive to have a really big focus on oral communication. So we get the students to do a lot of speaking in class and that is the way we teach them grammar and vocabulary um, and listening skills and stuff like that. It can benefit them in their future as well uh, to pick up other languages such as German or Chinese or whatever language that they're interested in. We also try to get them to actually experience French culture and to develop respect and appreciation for it. You know, anytime you learn a new language, you're opening the door to um, speak with new people, to learn about a new culture, and just experience um, another part of God's wonderful creation. Hi, my name is Danny DeYoung, and I teach English and textiles at Abbey Christian. One of the great things about textiles is it gives the opportunity to be creative. Students make all kinds of different outfits, from garments for children, to their own pajamas, to beautiful dresses. One of the highlights of the program is the fashion show that happens in May during Celebration Week. About 500 people attend this incredible show. 
Switching gears a bit, let me talk a little bit about AP English. Advanced Placement is an international program for highly motivated and academic students. If you are interested in either of these programs, definitely talk to the academic counselor or you can talk to me for more information. Hi, my name is Rob Bucker and I teach science at Abbotsford Christian. Science is a study of God's creation. We understand that God is the creator of the universe, it's his creation. Our reason for studying the creation stems from the fact that we view the world a little differently. When an artist creates art, it's done to give pleasure to the artist. The artist creates it for his or her own purpose, but when we study the art, we learn about the artist. When we study it deeply, we might arrive at a level of understanding that gives us insight into what the artist had in mind, and if the artist is good, we can't help but be amazed at what they've done. When we study science, we acknowledge that God is the artist. We explore his creation and gain an understanding of who he is and how we might serve him. We come to know him as a God of order with many surprises and we realize that this creation is his. He's given it to us to sustain us and for our pleasure. Science is different because we see the world differently. I'm Patrick Nair. I am the social studies person here at uh, Average Christian School. And social studies is, let me be honest with you, it's spectacular. It's excellent. Uh, we teach, we debate, uh, we argue, we study history, uh, geography, and politics, and you are going to love it, and that really is all that you need to know. My experience in Nicaragua was much different than I had expected, and I'm sure the other members of the team would definitely agree. We spent most of our time with the students and teachers of Centro de Fe, either at the school, joining in their classes, playing with the younger kids, and performing in a talent show. We also did outings, which included a boat tour of Lake Managua, climbing a volcano, and playing sports. We really built personal relationships with the people at the school. Hi, I'm Trent Young, and I teach English. Um, in the English department, we study a lot of literature, and uh, we understand literature to be a dialogue between great thinkers, both Christian and non-Christian, uh, concerning what it means to be human. Um, so what the great thinkers do is they, they write about uh, what is good, what is true, what is beautiful. They also write about what is ugly and evil and um, sin. And uh, as Christians, we learn how to uh, attend to this conversation. So we read, we write, and we think about, uh, about all these issues so that we can be more effective servants to God and, um, and to our neighbors. Ultimately, we would like to participate in Christ's redemption of all of creation, and we use English as a, as a means by which to do that. Hello, I'm Ms. Stage, and I work in the International Student Program here at Abbotsford Christian School. We have a lot of exciting things that we offer to our international students. We have a lot of different events throughout the year, like going to a ropes course, a girls trip to Vancouver, a boys overnight trip to a cabin, and lots of different local activities as well. So we want our international students to feel very supported here at ACS. Hi, I'm Jack Borsma, and I teach physical education here at Abbotsford Christian, and I really enjoy it. It's great teaching the Phys Ed 9 and 10 students where we have to explore a variety of different individual and dual activities. We also have a very strong fitness program that we run inside of our, our PE program. In our Phys Ed 11 and 12 class, we do a lot of leisure oriented activities and we have a very strong leadership program where they do officiating. We also get to bring in our little kindergarten students and we get to train them as well. Our phys ed program has a huge range of activities and that's something that we're very proud of. We have an excellent facility with uh, excellent equipment to use. We hope that uh, your students will enjoy being part of the phys ed program. Hi, my name is Scott Visser. I'm one of the Bible teachers here at Abbotsford Christian Secondary. I want to tell you about our grade 12 Bible program. It is a module program where students get a chance to choose between four different modules. And we think this is exciting as students have some choice in what they're learning about. And we're also going to have a final presentation at the end of June for all of our grade 12 students. And the parents are welcome to come. A school isn't a building. A school is a group of people. We're excited about our passionate staff at ACS, sharing a common vision which we all believe and implement with energy and creativity. This leads to momentum in education which we believe changes lives. As we approach our 60th anniversary, we think about this beautiful old car and remember that some really great things have come from our past and we intend to take them into our future.